NYPD is looking for this man you see right here, who they say is a peeping Tom. Investigators say he's been harassing women in Mid-City and also in West Los Angeles. KCAL News reporter Rachel Kim has more. He obviously is a creeper, and that that's horrible. I don't think anyone should behave like that. The young women we spoke with on the 800 block of Croft Avenue in Beverly Grove are on alert after the LAPD released pictures of a suspect who they say harassed residents on their way home, then exposed himself and made crude comments to them. After the alarming incident just after midnight on January 28th, one of the victims thought he was gone. She saw that uh, he came back several more times uh, in the night uh, on her ring cameras. So that led us to be even more concerned about this. Detective Brent Hopkins says the suspect came back and stared in her windows until the victim yelled and chased him off. Police say they have video evidence to show he did the same thing twice on March 2nd. First in the 5700 block of West 6th Street, then again shortly afterwards in the 1200 block of Armacost Avenue. Always with the obscene comments, always uh, with his pants down, uh, always uh, following uh, young women as they're uh, returning home or like already in, in their home with the you know, where you can see through the window. Based on the suspect's mobility in one night, investigators believe he is in a car. So far, he's hit the areas of Mid City, West LA, and West Hollywood, all in the early morning hours. He targets women who live on the first floor of apartments with access from the streets. I'm sad to say that it doesn't surprise me. Um, that we as women kind of always have to be aware of it. Obviously, it's not okay that this guy's doing this. If you see something, you should say something. That's what detectives are hoping. The suspect is described as a 40 to 50 year old man with dark graying hair, a dark mustache. He's 5'10, around 180 pounds. Hopefully, based on all the information that comes in, we'll be able to piece together who this guy is and put a stop to this. Detective Hopkins tells us last night he got a call about a similar incident over in West Hollywood. So right now, he's working with detectives from the L.A. County Sheriff's Department and Beverly Hills Police to see if all these cases are connected by the same man. Again, if you recognize that suspect, you're asked to call the LAPD. Reporting from Beverly Grove, Rachel Kim, KCAL News.